Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Hayley and I hope you guys will stick around and check out all of my content. If you enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We're going to go to the party shop because whose birthday is it soon? It's my birthday! Your birthday! And how old are you going to be? Not this three. Yep, put the pinky down, remember? Show them. Three. Three. <laughs> and we're ready to go to the party shop now. Okay. So we stopped on the way home and mummy grabbed a coffee, an iced latte. It's my favourite at the moment. Ugh, I should have opened my tripod because I'm sick of holding my camera like this. <laughs> I'm walking down the street on clouds instead of the concrete I'm dancing through Everything's about to come my way Nothing can ruin my day No matter what anyone does or say I smile at fools No, I don't care cause I am on my way Up and I won't stop I won't slow down Steady on my feet I'm gonna rise Up, no I won't stop It is mine Who did you say it was? A beard like G. <laughs> beard like G. Beard. <laughs> so apparently that's you, Dad. <laughs> Are you funny? The fruit from this lucky day. Yeah, I am on my way. I won't slow down. Yeah, I am on my way. I won't slow down I'm strolling down the street With all of my favorite songs on repeat I'm dancing through Everything's about to come my way And I don't care if you spill coffee on me Or if the sky is grey or blue No, I don't care cause I am on my way Up and I won't stop I won't slow down Standing on my feet I'm gonna rise up No, I won't it is my time. This is something I never thought I'd be having to do. <laughs> Not the kind of coffee I like. <laughs> Mum likes. Somebody a little tired. You want to go home for a nap? Yeah. Okay. I love you. Okay. Okay, you guys. So we're home, obviously. Um, so I have quite the haul here. We went to the reject shop. We went to Officeworks. We went to Red Dot. A $2 shop. And we went to Kmart. So there's quite a few things I've picked up. Um for the party and may have bought a few items that aren't associated to the party but hey that's what happens when you go to Kmart am I right <laughs> okay so I'm going to show you what I got for the party and then I'm going to show you my little haul of stuff that I got for non-party related so um, I'm not sure if I said earlier or not but the theme of the party is blippy so we're having a blippy party and obviously in Australia there is the absolute bare minimum of blippy stuff available. So the only thing I'm able to get is like blippy little toys for their party bags. So that's fine because then I can use my creative skills to come up with this whole party. Only problem being there's not much orange stuff around so that's going to be hard. But... I'm thinking for Blippi we're going to have a obviously a table setting which is going to be like the main thing with all the food on it, somewhere they can put presents and photos and stuff like that. So Blippi colours are obviously blue and orange so I got this blue um, tablecloth. I liked it because it's trying to get the shine off. It's a floor length one so it covers the whole table, you can put things under the table because we're having it at a park so you can kind of hide all the bits and pieces that you've like carried everything in um, an esky under there possibly or something like that 
So that just looks really nice and that was actually only $20 so we can keep that for future parties. It's quite um, heavy duty by the look of that so I'm quite happy for that. And that just fits on our trestle table, nice and easy. So that's going to be the base of it and then I found a little tablecloth, um, a little table cover. Um, that I can cut up and put as the suspenders over the table. So that's going to be our main foundation for the table. Um, and that was only $3 from the $2 shop. So $3 from a $2 shop. Sounds funny. And then I got just some blue party plates for food and some blue cups. I was going to try and get creative and maybe put a little bow tie on the cups and get some orange napkins to go with these ones. So we'll make them all blippy like. Then I picked up this from Kmart, which is a photo bunting. So as you can see, maybe a photo bunting kit. So it's got your little pegs down there with the rope and you can put little photos in there. And I was thinking I might hang that at the bottom like a garland on the table. Or there is a couple of trees there that I could probably pop that on there. So it's just good to see the couple of photos of Isaiah as he's kind of gone through the years. Um, from Spotlight, I picked up these little cookie cutters. I thought they're really good to have anyway. But I thought if I make some... Um, I was thinking of doing a little fairy bread or cookies even. So I could do the blippy glasses and the bow tie as well so I liked that they were in one set this was only like four dollars as well so it's something we can keep forever yeah so I got them I picked up these um, as I actually pointed these out so little party props and Blippi if you guys are familiar with him he works in he does like construction he's always got a construction hat on um, we've got glasses, we've even got construction orange glasses, which I thought were cool. And we can just kind of muck around with them. Fun zone, get the kids to sit there and I might try and make a backdrop um, so they can all stand there and take photos, like a little photo booth. I thought that would be really cute. I found this little bow tie in the $2 shop. So I thought I might try and con his dad into wearing this. Um, yeah, so it's cute. It was the last one there, so I was going to get me a matching one as well, but yeah, we'll see. So if he doesn't wear it, I'll wear it. <laughs> then I bought this plain white shirt. Um, on his first birthday, I actually made um, his shirt for him. I made an iron on, like, I'm one. I can't remember what it said, but um, I'll try and get a picture for it here. So I'm going to make his shirt again. This time I'm a little bit more experienced, so I know what I'm doing. But um, yeah, just a plain white shirt from Kmart. I think that was $2, can't go wrong. So plain white shirt. And then I'm going to make a iron-on transfer. So with the blue, and they had no orange, but I found it in this little set. So I don't think I'll ever use the other two colors, but we've got the orange. So I'm gonna make my own pattern on the shirt for him. So I got that. If you count it, I also bought a bag for one dollar. <laughs> okay, so that is the party prep um, for today that I could find. We had um, a couple of stops for toilet training, so it just made my headspace. You know, I, I could have bought so much more, but um, my head wasn't in the game because we kept getting distracted. So this is our first time at the shop. Um, with Isaiah in full jocks. So he's been toilet training for a little while now and he nails it. He's so good at toilet training. But when we're out at the shops, obviously it's proved to be too much of a distraction and he's not listening to his body when he's ready. So we were at the checkouts in Office Works and the poor little guy did a wee um, and he was so upset. He was He gets so upset with himself when he does it. So um, I had to discreetly tell the lady and she was really good. She was like, it's okay, mate, it's all good, we all do it. And she went and got a mop and was really good instead of being like, oh, like, it was really good. So that was handy. So the poor guy, 
yeah, did a wee and I didn't expect it and I didn't even think, I didn't pack any clothes to go with us. So we had to come all the way home. So we had to go nudie in the car seat and then um, I got him some pants and jocks and we went out again and then he kind of weed again towards the end. So yeah, he did all right. And then he would have seen that I had to tip the potty into my coffee cup, which was empty. Thank God I got the coffee this morning, by the way, because I don't know what I would have done otherwise. <laughs> so I'm new to this as well. This is all toilet training learning for me as well. Anyway, so a little personal haul. Um, I got some more vinyl for myself. I'm really loving my, I don't have a Cricut machine, but I have um, a Silhouette, which is exactly the same pretty much. Um, it's just a different brand and I think it's more American based because I'm finding I can't find as much like in store. So yeah, I just got some more vinyl because I've been really enjoying making vinyl stuff with it. So I got that, that was Spotlight. And I also saw this gorgeous little color as well. So this is like a blush pink and I just thought it was stunning. So I thought that would look good on like my roller bottles and stuff when I make them. Um, and I'm hoping it will go on that. But that was from Spotlight and it was like $10 for the little roll. So there's that. I also saw, where did I get these from? I think these were Spotlight as well, just at the checkouts. <laughs> um, I got some more of these little hair ties. These are the only ones that can hold my hair up. Yes, it's short, but my goodness, you guys, it is thick. So these are the ones that can hold my hair up without me getting a headache. And I just loved like the blush colors and stuff like that. So I got these, I think they were, yep, $6. So happy with those. So I go office works. I picked myself up a new tripod. It's just a cheapy one. I had the Kmart one and it actually snapped off the little screw at the top. And it was actually like stuck in my camera. So I couldn't use it. I couldn't put it onto another tripod. It was basically stuffed until my hobby could work his magic and get it out. So this was only $15. Um, and it's got the bendy legs, as you can see. So that's going to make, you know, a vlogger very happy. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to try that one out. We have plans to do those Woolworth seeds and plant them and for them to flourish and be amazing. I'm hoping that will happen. <laughs> so I've bought some gloves for me to work with mulch and everything. So these are really cheap from the reject shop. I think they're only like $2 or $3 and they got flowers on them. They're pretty. So I got those. I found, I can't remember where I got these from. They might have been Spotlight, but they may have been somewhere else. I don't know. But I got these clips. So I don't know if you can see the colours. That's coming up as purple, but it's actually like a grey. Like, they're matte. So they have a matte finish, and they're stunning. So, yeah, I'm really liking that. That is coming up purple, but it's a real, like, grey, nice charcoal colour. And I got some of these... You would think that we are past this stage, baby proofing. However, my dude has figured out he can drag his kitchen helper over to the fridge and help himself, but he leaves the fridge open. So I'm going to pop this right at the top um, so that he can't open it and he'll have to ask because Keaton caught him the other day sitting on the couch, um, literally with his finger in the Philadelphia cheese and was just like eating it. Yum. <laughs> so yeah we need to stop that then I got some pretty nails I am sick to death of my nails um, you guys would have seen a little while back if you've been you know one of my OGs um, I put a video up in November or December whenever it was um, when I had my miscarriage I've been a stress head ever since and my nails have suffered so bad. I don't know if you can see that, but they are disgusting. It's my port of call is to bite my nails when I'm stressed and I've been stressed for months. So I have like no nails, they're disgusting and I just want to feel nice. You know, when you look at your hands, you just want to be like, ah, oh, nails are so pretty. So I saw these 
and I'm gonna give them a go. They've got like the French tip. Okay, two more to go guys, stick with me. So I got this gratitude journal from Kmart. Um, one thing I was reflecting on in the bath the other night was gratitude. I don't do it much. Um, I have a lot of things in my life that I should be grateful for, but I never acknowledge it. So if I can get in the habit of writing in this probably every morning and every night, then I could probably change the way my mindset is and I could just really reflect on what I am grateful for. So I loved this book and it was on sale. They dropped, they'd marked it down to like $3.75. So that's good. So I love that it's got an in, like an intentional page. So you've got the quote of the day. Wait till that zooms in. So you've got the quote of the day and you've got three things you're grateful for. Um, today's focus, so you can focus specifically on things. There's those gross nails I was telling you about. <laughs> and then you've got how you felt today. So you've got a couple of options like relieved, happy, whatever. Um, you can document happy moments and what's that last one? And then you can prepare yourself for tomorrow. So I love that. I love how intentional it is and I think that's really going to help me in a lot of ways. And for $3.75 to change my life, I'm here for it. <laughs> okay, last one. Um, I never buy sheets or bath towels or anything that's not from Kmart because I just, I've never really had the money for it. So when I went there today, um, I saw that they had a 50% off sale on all their bath stuff. So I like the fact that this is a bath sheet, not just a bath towel. So it's a little bit bigger, it's a little bit pink, and it was a little bit cheap. So I ended up scoring this for $17. So stoked. So it's a big ass towel. And I'm excited to use that. I needed a pink towel. I was going to buy a Kmart one and do you know what? 17 bucks is not that bad. So yeah, <laughs> that's it from me for my haul and I hope you guys enjoyed our little video um, going shopping and pouring wee in coffee cups and <laughs> you know, just the mum life stuff. I really appreciate you guys hanging out right till the end. I love it. Um, and I appreciate you guys. So make sure you give me a like comment and laugh along with me throughout the video and um i love you guys for being here bye bye <laughs> bye bye I won't say goodbye yet. Can I change your mind?